hello everyone to another katan video so i am in the fourth position and pink immediately quit so pink has been replaced by a bot however let's take a look at the board the 8510 seems to be an excellent spot you get the best uh, board and the best ore on board yeah and then it kind of locks locks out all the ore uh because the other option is only a 3 or a 2 hmm i am considering a34 which seems to be a excellent spot as well uh 6910 is also good but okay yellow takes 6910 completely fine with that So at this point, I think I might go for a three four and three four five. Although three four five isn't a lot of production, I will point to the right and build on the. Uh, I think I can. I'll be able to build on a three. That said, maybe yellow wants to take the a three directly for himself. So that is a is slightly a risky play. the other option i have is going for something like 642 or yeah yeah i think um, my plan of going for something like 843 and 453 is possible but uh, it's it is agreed it is risky but i think i can make it work if I can even go to the left and get the six three or and the three to one port on the top, so I will do that. And yeah, I will start with the road in hand. Yeah. So the worst case scenario over here is yellow goes for eight three. But uh, I think yellow has quite a lot of board open. They can go for. Four eleven nine, and then build on the wheat port. Or so yellow does go for eight three. Wow. Bot picks up the four eleven nine, and I think at this point six four two will be picked up by red. So red has an excellent game over here. Yeah, I think six four two is an easy choice for red. I will try and build on six three. I do have a lot of uh, wood and uh, brick, so there are a few uh, options for me, like six three, six eleven five, and the eight ten. Wow, so pretty. uh decent rolls uh, in the very beginning for everyone except for me I would love to roll a seven, but I roll a twelve. I don't think the twelve helps me much. Yeah, I think my first action should be building on the three to one port, so that I can make use of the extra wood. Uh, sorry, extra brick that I will have. And I do need a few early fours and threes to roll as well. I think red can do a four is to one, and uh, 
go towards the 3 to 1 port over here. So they get a dev card uh, instead, okay, because they were able to trade with yellow. Another six, so that's a very good start for yellow and uh, red. I don't think my game is completely over uh, just yet, but uh, yeah, it will be a little difficult for sure. Let me try something like this. Not expecting that trade to go through at all, but. Uh, yeah, it doesn't go through and uh, yellow gets a dev card. Another 6 rolled, wow. So a little slow start for me but uh, hopefully the curve will normalize. So pretty sure uh, red will do a 4 is to 1 if nothing else works. Yeah, red does do a 4 is to 1 now and I'm pretty sure they will build towards the 3 is to 1 port or that is where they should and yeah they do do that. So yellow gets another dev card. I do roll a 7. And I think uh, I will be targeting red. I get a break. Okay, I can offer a break. I don't need it. want a uh, I can do something like this now probably you so yellow cannot do that because yellow doesn't have two cards so I'll just end my turn here not a lot of that I can do so red didn't play their dev card okay and at this point they might block the 8 break if they want to target me or they can block the 6 or 9 if they want to target yellow if they do block the 8 break a little unfortunate there but uh, that's how it goes sometimes So 5 does roll and I am able to build a settlement. Let's see if I can get a row, get a wood. In that case I will build two roads. So bot doesn't want to do any trades with me which is completely fine. 
so at this point i'll just build my road and end my turn sorry build my settlement and end my turn that's what i meant yeah so now red is a lot more scary scary because I need another wood so that uh, let's see if I can get a trade like this so that I can go to the six eleven Seven is also fine. I will still continue targeting red. I do get a sheep. Uh, don't think I can do much with it though. Uh, let me just ask for a food. And let me see if I can get an ore. Uh, because none of my trades are going through. I. Not sure if I should be placing a road here just yet. Uh, the bot might cut me out. But holding on to cards is also not a good idea because, yeah. So I'll just place my road here and uh, end my turn there. So the eight does roll at the right time. Uh, the ore is blocked. Four is also a good roll for me. So yellow targets red as well. That is good. I would like to roll a five. So another 8 does roll, um, let's see if I can get any trades. I think yellow might be willing to give me an, so yellow wants to give me a sheep, uh, that is not what I am looking for. Uh, let me check if they want to give me an ore instead. Yeah, they accept that trade that's a nice deal for me and uh, let's see if i can get another ore actually i can just get a city at this point by converting by doing a three to one oh uh, let me see the board i think that would not be such a bad option and i will build on the four five three because i think that will be blocked a le little less if i don't build it on the four five three eight becomes an easy block although eight will still be blocked now i guess yeah And the 8 rolls just then, so that's a little unlucky. So 5 gives me 2 wood. I'm surely asking for an over. Maybe I'll ask for three cards or uh, in for two wood. 
It's basically me asking for a dev card. And the fact that yellow accepts it is very good for me. So another 8 does roll and I am again blocked. Just get a single dev card. A knight is decent. So as I've already said, 3 and 4 are excellent rolls for me. Another 8, wow, been blocked on 8 almost thrice now and make that 4 times. So pretty unlucky there but uh, that's how it goes sometimes. I'm surely blocking red again. And this time I am able to make use of the 8. don't think I will be able to get any trades though. So red is willing to give me an over and yeah so these aren't uh, so I am not too keen on doing any of these trades maybe if I go for something like this. Or how about something like this? No, if not that, then maybe this. How about this? So this way I just, I'm looking for a dev card this turn. I might just run out of time. And I do run out of time, that's unlucky. And they'll steal from me and they take away the ore. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. Yeah, so now red is a pretty huge threat, I would say. Um, actually, I won't go for any trades. Although that seems enticing, not something that I want. I will ask for a over as well. If that is possible, then okay. Okay, that that trace goes through. And I roll a seven. So that is bad. I had a settlement in hand. I could have even had a dev card. But now I think I'll just Yeah, I think I'll just uh, Get a dev card and end my turn I get a monopoly which is a good dev card So a couple of sixes and nines and I'll be able to monopoly on wheat good for me a 
seven rules at the very wrong time again so i again have to give away quite a few of my cards and yellow i think will just block the four and steal from me or blocks the five and okay steals from red which is good I will ask for a wheat. I do roll a seven, and uh, I think I'll still keep on targeting red. Let's see if I can get another uh, dev card. No, so I'll end my turn. Three is nice. Twelve is fine. Doesn't help anyone. Another seven. So a seven has rolled each time I had more than. I think this time I will want to keep my ore. steal from me uh, which is fine i mean all three of us are on four i think uh, red is on five but uh, yeah that's okay and yellow will soon be able to take the lead with after they build a settlement on the wheat port yeah, i immediately roll a seven so that is good this time i will steal from yellow I get my ore back, which is completely fine. End my turn. So nine basically means that there are three wheat in in game. Another seven bots are generally erratic. Luckily, bot doesn't do anything out of the way. another 3 so at this point i might do a trade like this actually let me see if i can get a trade like this this will be giving me a city what about a trade like this i think uh, yellow might accept this trade Yellow is taking their time. How about if I offer we uh, sheep to someone? So don't think any trade is going through. Uh, if that's the case, I'll just do a four is to one and okay. So they do accept this trade. I think I'll just get a dev card. And it's a victory point, a decent one. I'll end my turn though. Uh, eight does roll, uh, so there are four ore in game, and uh, yellow has three of them. Yeah, I might go for that trade uh, for the simple reason that four. I already have an extra brick. Another six. So yellow will have to do a four is to one, or they will just go for a dev card. Yeah, they do get a four is to one. Not sure if they are able to build a city though. They do get a city. Wow, that's nice. So 
for what then another eight does roll mm. I am considering playing my monopoly at this point I might just do that and I do get quite a lot I think I'll go for a settlement uh, actually after rethinking I believe I'll just go for a city on the 834 that seems to be a decent option and then I'll end my turn so a 4 will give me another city now a 7 pretty sure the 8 gets blocked yeah nothing out of the way there and the 8 gets blocked so that is a little unlucky but it's okay another 8 so I have been blocked quite a few times on 8 now and uh, not much I can do about it Seven, hopefully bot blocks red and yellow yeah the uh, bot does that which is good but I think yellow might immediately play the knight and block my eight again yeah actually yellow can yeah yellow does block the eight again A nine roll so yellow has a city in hand okay so they are going for the largest army I do roll a four and I think all I can do is get a single dev card with it do a 4 is to 1 and get a dev card a knight is ok especially because now I am the target 3 is a pretty decent roll a 5 rolls that's a rare roll this game again block on the 8 so I would like a 4 to roll at this point uh, that will give me my settlement and a dev card yeah although I am on 7 cards I will play the knight steal from yellow I do roll the 9 but uh, let's see if I can get any brick no uh, if, let's see if anybody wants a wood if no trades go through I'll just get another dev card I get another victory point which I would have liked a knight so that I can compete for the largest army yeah, I think uh, I still get blocked over here okay targeting red is just wrong 
Yeah, and I think the eight gets blocked now. Four gets blocked. Another five, so I will be able to get a death card again. Let's see if I can get this trade. Or maybe this trade through. So because none of the trades are going through, I'll just build my settlement and end my turn. I am pretty close to winning, I just need to build the longest road and I think uh, yellow might be pretty close to winning as well. Red gets their city. I'm surprised why bot is still targeting red. I think yellow should be surely the target. But I guess again I get blocked. Maybe the 5 wood gets blocked and red gets stolen from. No, I do get stolen from again. Mm, yellow might just play a knight. Okay, they don't. I will still continue blocking yellow. get a sheep it doesn't do anything for me so I'll just end my turn and eight. I could have blocked the 8 I did not do that uh, 7 and the bot still steals from red surprising there Yellow might just play their knight and uh, steal from me. Yeah. Okay. A ten roll, so maybe yellow might be able to win the game if they have one victory point and if they are able to build a city no they are not able to do that uh, 6 rolls uh, 6 doesn't help me at all let's see if any trades go through I'm not sure what my plan should be I want to build the longest road but with rolls the way they are I don't think I can do much Uh, maybe I should be a little fo more focused on that and hence I will build a road this turn. But now red should surely target yellow. They can block the three maybe. I think that's what they are thinking but they should be blocking either the 6 or the 9. The 9 is a decent block. And now red gets their second city. 5 is a not 5 is not a bad roll at all. I would like if a 4 rolls, a 
seven rolls. So now I think again they will steal from me. Okay, still targeting red, but uh, is it game over? So eight will give me a victory if uh, yellow doesn't win in this turn. Four rules, wow, what a what unlucky timing there. not sure what I can do I'll just have to build a single road and end my turn there uh, six that I think uh, if seven isn't rolled uh, yellow will be able to win the game uh, seven does roll and bot should target yellow bot still targets red wow that is very very surprising uh, 10 doesn't i might help uh, yellow but doesn't help me much i need a 8 or a 4 or a 3 as well Another 10, wow, that's just bad. I don't think bot will trade with me. So, maybe that is game over. And I end up on the second spot. So yeah, uh, lucky rolls there in the end for yellow. I don't have a sh V2 offer and God didn't want my sheep. Five is rolled, not sure what. I mean, yeah, so they have a year of plenty, so they just win the game by building the longest road there. Oh wow, they don't go for the longest road. That is surprising. That's just a flaw. That's just a mistake. Yellow just missed the entire game there. And that will just give me the victory and uh, GG. So a win after a very very long time. I guess it's been almost uh, 15 to 20 videos since I haven't won. And in this game also I won only because Yellow built a settlement rather than going for a longest road over here. So I was very lucky over there. Uh, I mean, uh, this was a clear mistake by Yellow. They had a year of plenty, they just had to build a road and they would have won the game. Uh, but uh, that's how it goes sometimes. Uh, I, I was lucky and anyways, uh, let's see the ELO I got. I get, I, I am plus 9, around plus 9 in this game, so that pushed me in the low 3000s, which is very good. I mean, compared to what I was in the previous game, uh, previous video. And uh, hopefully this is the turnaround and I uh, start rising back again to where I want to be. Anyways, uh, bye for now and see you again in the next video.